Welcome to our channel and welcome to another one of our videos. Tonight what we're going to cover is our nightly daily trade report for December 2nd, 2021. This is the first report of this kind that we're performing. If you guys want one report a day during the work days or one report a weekend, please put it down below. Because I'm an active trader sometimes, I might do multiple trades a day. Or I might do no trades in a day and just do a couple of trades in a week. So I just need some feedback of when you guys want these reports so you guys know my position and what I think what's going on with the market. Today, it's going to be a, this video is going to be a little bit longer, but normally I want to keep it between two to two to five minutes at the most. These are going to be short reports once you guys find out all my positions. So let's cover the market. This is a snapshot of the market. All the futures are kind of mixed. Now, what we had this morning was the weekly unemployment numbers were better than expected. And that's why the market went up today. Now, tomorrow, we got November payroll numbers. I got this uh, information right here that I'm going to put down below in the description. Now, this is just a snapshot of my stock and options positions. I have all these stocks here. I'm not going to go through them here. And these are the options only, and we're going to discuss these options. So let's check out our trades. Please smash the like button and subscribe. All right, this is a long list of positions that I currently have, and I'm going to show you some of the trades that we perform. Now, a firm I just picked up today, uh, it's going to expire tomorrow on 3rd of December. Put option spread. It's the only one I have. So as long as the share price don't drop below 113, we get to keep the premium. This, this whole position will expire worthless. Next position I rolled over my SoFi that I purchased into the next following week into 10 December. Nano Dimension here. I still have that position that I've picked up. You guys might have seen my video on it. This is Square. This is a new position I picked up today. Now it expires on the 10th of December. I went with the 195 slash 202.5s for the option spread. Now these are all going to be bull called option spreads. Just like the video that... I performed the other day. I'll place that at the end of this video so you guys understand what type of trade these are. Now, I also picked up PayPal. That expires on the 17th of December as well. Robinhood, I picked up them on Monday. Tilray, I picked up on Monday. They all expire the 17th of December here. Salesforce, I picked up yesterday because of what the Fast Money guys were talking about this company and a couple other advisors on CNBC, Jim Cramer as well. So I picked this thing up because I, th I thought it dropped too quick. Disney, I picked up because of Jim Cramer is in his travel trust. And he put out the other night that this is a good stock because it dropped too much as well. Now these two positions were new positions for today. The company's name is Open Door Technology. It's a technology company in real estate. And this is from the unusual activity from the halftime report that came out today. And this also position here, VTR was from the halftime report from CNBC that came out today as well. I took both those positions and they don't expire until the monthly options in January. Now these four positions here are basically covered calls against stock positions that we own. Ford, Affirm, Snap, and Micron. And one closed position here was Revion. All right, appreciate you guys watching our, our first video on this uh, nightly, daily report. Tell us what your thoughts are of, of this report, if I should do it daily or as needed, or, or just perform a weekly report. Place them down below in the comments, and then we'll go from there. I appreciate what you guys do out there by watching us. You guys take care of yourselves out there. Until next time, this is Sonny. I'm out.